Hi everyone, I am Pritham Sau. I work as a partner custom engineer with Google Cloud. As a part of this today's exciting series on YouTube, we will be covering how you can innovate your SAP landscape on Google Cloud. So let's get started. So if you look at today's challenges, SAP enterprises are going through, it's primarily twofold. First and foremost, they want to keep their lights on for their business, that is maintaining business continuity. And the second one, they're looking at for the cost savings approach so that they can get economic relief. So we have been working our customers on the SAP landscapes to help them get started on this journey. And we believe at the end of the session, you will benefit from some of the key takeaways so that you can embark your journey with us. So if you look at SAP enterprise are going through two primary major imperatives. So they're looking to modernize their SAP landscape by embarking the cloud journey to get economic relief as well as to maintain the business continuity. And let's not forget about the mandate from SAP that 2025 got extended to 2027. So that doesn't mean the SAP customers cannot innovate on Google Cloud. So they can do it. The question is when and where they want to get started with us. So what's our relationship with SAP? So if you look at Alphabet Inc, which is the primary ink for Google Cloud and, and it's into major verticals as well. So into media, retail, life science, and CPG. And when we started our modernization and innovation journey a few years back, we faced similar challenges and imperatives. So we understand what can be the challenges look like. And as a result, we have one of the largest S4 HANA implementations in the world. And we want to give our best practices and learnings to you so that you can embark the journey with trust and confidence. And when you look at SAP, so when they wanted to get started on the flagship product, which is S4, they were looking for best best in class, smart engineered cloud infrastructure. So they chose Google at that point in time. So Google is by far the best engineered cloud platform. As a result, they have 10,000 developers working on the S4 HANA development in a data center dedicated by Google to SAP. So what it means for customers like you, you can start your innovation or modernization journey with SAP, which is best in class enterprise software on Google Cloud with seamless transformation and migration approach. So let's understand the manufacturing facing barriers when they're trying to embark on the journey of industry 4.0. So it's primarily threefold. So they have a lot of legacy and distributed infrastructures, which in turn leads to high maintenance cost. And that has become a IT technical debt and data silos. Let's not forget about it. So in enterprises, especially in the manufacturing phase, you have SAP data that sits in the enterprises. You have non-SAP data like IoT data or operational data. And as a result of silos, the manufacturers are not able to draw insights from the data. And let's not forget the need of IT and OT specialized talent. And it's becoming difficult for the manufacturers to gain real-time visibility into their operations. And we have been helping our customers in this journey. So let me highlight a few of the interesting use cases where we have helped our customers on various manufacturing use cases. So whether it's supply chain transparency, where you are trying to uh, enrich your SAP data with non-SAP data, that is real-time production and logistics data from our suppliers, or it can be your predictive maintenance use cases, or you're looking to automate the procurement process so that you can bring in the transparency in the enterprises or you are looking for demand forecasting. So there are n number of use cases we are helping our customers in this journey. To cite an example, so one of the manufacturing customers started migrating the SAP landscape onto Google Cloud, and later on, they could stream the SAP data from the customer soft floor in real time to Google Cloud for remote equipment monitoring. As a result, they could activate the predictive maintenance use cases. Isn't that interesting? Similarly, later on, they are now trying to blend their on-premise applications with the cloud native applications on the Google Cloud so that they can better service their customers and partner ecosystem. And one of the other interesting cases I want to highlight in the manufacturing space as well. So one of the manufacturing space without bringing immediate, really, immediate change to their underlying SAP applications moved as it is, that is Sweet and HANA to Google Cloud and they could get significant benefits from moving to Google Cloud apart from cost savings. So the first and foremost, they could reduce the invoice processing time from 13 hours to just two hours. And the ERP backup system was initially taking six hours and they could reduce to just six minutes. So that's the massive and the innovation journey our customers in the manufacturing space 
are innovating with us. So let's look at how retailers are facing continuous pressure amidst this current market change. So if you look at what are the current trends for the retail industry, they're looking for rapid growth of e-commerce platforms, which is the current change and trend. And if we get a shopping experience, wherever the, uh, the purchasers or the buyers can buy from the platform anytime, anywhere, any place. And of course, let's not forget, the users are expecting more personalized experience with the retail platform. And one of the more things was added, the failed this retail platform to stay more competitive and undergo transformation is expected a rise of insurgents. And no wonder that the paradigm shifts clearly points out the health and safety is paramount importance. And of course, the value based purchasing, the area where retailers are trying to is innovate in this arena. And the users are looking at magnified in store experience. Similarly, like physical stores, they're looking at a seamless omni channel experience where they're buying from the physical stores or might be the online retail stores. And if you look at the continued uncertainty in this space, is the unprecedented demand, which currently typically happens during the Black Friday sales or the Cyber Mondays. And let's not forget the volatility and lack of visibility in the supply chain, the inventory and the sales. So there are a lot of these challenges and let's not forget the data silos, whether they're using the merchandise system or they might be using the financial system like ECC or S4 financials with SAP marketing cloud uh, while the retailers are going through a digital revolution. So let me highlight a few of the interesting cases where we have been helping our customers in this journey. So one of the largest B2B wholesaler was looking for a consolidation of 100 plus SAP financials. As a result, they could move into a large single instance of S4 financial on GCP and they reduced the latency. And beyond that, they also got the benefits of the cost optimization on the Google Cloud and later on activated interesting use cases like customer analytics and empower their marketing campaign so that they can build a sustainable system to meet their customers demand in near real time. And one of the other customers got started in just 16 weeks. That was from start to production. And later on, they built a connected system so that they have a real time visibility to inventory and the sales data. So most of our customers starts with the infrastructure story where they're looking to migrate the SAP landscape, whether it's ECC or S4. And to do that, we are helping our customers to get started in weeks, not in months, with the power of automation on the Google Cloud. And we understand SAP customers require best, uh, best user experience. With the power of Google Network, we are helping our customers to give that low latency, best end user experience to them. And talking about the, uh, the downtime, even during the maintenance window, we take care of those capabilities so that we keep the lights on for you as a SAP customer and we focus everything behind the roads so that you can proceed with the business as business as usual. So most of the customers start with the infrastructure story, but they stay with us for the integration insights and innovation. If you look at SAP applications talks to not only SAP, which might be non SAP systems as well as SAP cloud platforms, something like Hybris, Ariba, so as a result, they need a strong, secure, robust API platform. There will, there what your APG can help you. And by default, APG is the platform of choice for most of our SAP enterprises in this journey. And we talk about building a strong data culture where the access to data insights, not only for technical as well as business users with the power of BigQuery, you can do that. And bringing in the power of AI ML to data rather than exporting the data out of BigQuery. When you are talking about AIML with Google Cloud, sky is the limit where you can keep exploring all the interesting use cases to solve your business problem. So I would like to thank you for your time and hope to hear you from you soon so that you can get started with us in the exciting journey of modernization for your SAP application.